You beat it a minute faster or an hour and 32 minutes. Nice. Even though, I mean, if it was a rough playthrough and it was still faster, that's still a good sign because that means that there's, that you're doing better and there's still room for improvement. You haven't plateaued. <laughs> Let me skip this. As cool as that song is. Oh, you did die once, so it didn't count. Ah. The original trilogy is pretty rough. I, I don't. I, I think it's amazing that people are able to speedrun that game because it. It just sounds like it's so it's stressful. Oh, yes, that's right. I I saved because we ran out of time. But I wasn't going to send the calling card anyway, because I was going to go to the Shibuya jail. All right, time to go wild! And try to fight that dire shadow. Yeah. <laughs> RNG of that game, oh boy. <laughs> Ooh, that's loud. You're gonna get kicked out. Don't do that. Is it in Maraku City? Where is it? It's not Central Street. It's in... Bunkamachi, I believe. <laughs> Bork. <laughs> now that we're here, let's get going. Now then. The lag is so real in this game sometimes. <laughs> huh. Whip. Maybe I should have gone the other way. This is our chance. Let's get him. Huh. What's up? Let's go. Hang on a sec. Stop. Yeah, I know. What now? We are gonna fight it. Please don't get in our way. Travis step! Okay, let's take them out. <laughs> Move my legs. Oh, fear. Be careful! Stop being afraid, stop being afraid! Target its weakness to win! Persona! Take it! Okay. Oh, no. Sophie's stamina is running low. She needs 
Stop dying, Fox. <laughs> Please. Stop dying. We kinda need everyone for this. Incoming attack. Nice work, Oracle. Oh my god. You'll get yours. Fair warning. I'm gonna be wrong. Fine. Let's go. Rabbit step. Oh, nice, Joker. You hit its weakness. That's why you're the Yeah. Go ahead. Okay, got it. Huh. You're the Thank you. No. no. Come on. Sure, if an hour is possible on PSN download, so much time. Yeah, it really do. This fight is tough. It certainly feels that way. Instant tech speed versus slow. Please allow me. 
Oh, sure. Other than the fact that it missed. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Times like these, I'm glad we're on your side. off until it's Not now. Here. Defenses were gone. Uh, 
Yeah, I brought the wrong person for this. <laughs> And there he is. <laughs> Burst the I suppose that'll do. What? Oh shit, people are multiple people are dead. Let's go. Gotta exploit those weaknesses! Simply astonishing! Let me get that one! Let's move warning! It's gonna be rough! You're not gonna- I'm just- Oh god. Dodge that, please! You did not dodge that! that I used all those items. No, I did not. Okay, good, because <laughs> I need to not bring... What was that week to? Wind. Wind was one of the ones. It was Wind and Curse. The flame in the loading screen made it look like my arm was on fire. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Hmm. Oh yeah, there isn't an enemy book, so I can't really like look, can I? I should write something. I just can't fight this yet. So I'm using this as an opportunity. For some reason, I can wiggle Arsene if I use the right stick. Interesting. I'm 
Uh, he's moving like this because I'm moving the stick. I don't think that was intentional. I was just like, oh man, look at those shoes. <laughs> and then I realized he can, I can make him, I can make him do a little dance. I want to check out though. This is an interesting team. <laughs> I think I dropped some frames because Arson rotated. <laughs> I wish there was a checkpoint. Teleport to the entrance. Hello, Dinafo. Let's go. Fuck am I doing in Shibuya? I was trying to fight the dire shadow. Why don't we see what that is? <laughs> yes, that's that. I am still not ready to fight the dire shadow. But I want to check one other thing. Hey, what do you think that is? Hmm. So it was only during the request that I could fight the boss Looks again? Like there aren't any shadows here. Huh? Huh? 
really? Oh, you need to re you need to accept the request again. Oh. Hmm. And give me a second. <laughs> it's not like I did anything of value while I was in there. Because I want to, because I think it's cool. I, it's just kind of... Alrighty, then we're heading back. It's kind of odd how you have to accept the request every time, and it's not just there. I'm guessing you don't net the rewards from doing it over and over again. As you did from doing it the first time. Let's get to work. Gather at the hut. Here's what I found. You're doing this one? Okay, let's do oh. it. You're doing this one? You can You're doing do this one? Repeatedly. Oh. Oh, you're okay. Why are you squeaking? Why are you squeaking? <laughs> no. I'll open the door for you, but... I, we're not going anywhere. You already went outside. Someone is playing with the cats, and one of the toys has a bell in it, so he was hearing that little bell and was getting excited. <laughs> You're doing this one? So I could You're get rice and onion, request? and I could repeatedly get quick fix A. You're already working on this one. This one gives me just money to do it over and over again, which I, I don't mind. That's pretty cool. I want to make money. I can. Ow! I do wish there was a checkpoint at the All right. castle, though. <laughs> I understand why there's not. It's not like that area is far from here. Now then, nor is it a very large area, but it's still kind of like... I think I see something over there. <laughs> In the distance, barking. Uh, I'm sensing something nearby. Ah! Sure. Let me 
amazing. So record time. <laughs> it's done. No, it's just you. do those requests. Very nice. Sounds of disaster. Ready for an ass kicking? Okay, let's take the map. We can do it. The bloody paddle. Yeah, it's 700 per, as well as 10k um every single time. It's kind of crazy. Sweet, let's bounce. Seven hundred's pretty good right now. The only problem is, is I wish it would just take you straight back to the hideout and not <laughs> this area, but it's fine. Hmm? Probably gonna wanna buy that Gutan burger. Was it the pot? What you looking for? Oh, that's dope. This Ooh, is not bad. bad. So I'll take that. That the pineapple. What will it be? Is that all you need? It's thank you. Oh, definitely the pineapple. Actually, anything that gives me SP. I need to be Come buying again. every time I exit the jail. And then, of course, the How can I help you? Burger, because Will this, this be is kind of crazy, go. and you, you only can buy one. <laughs> hmm? Hmm? 
there's also the supermarket. Well, hello. The coffee beans, they just are never coming back, are they? We recommend that. Can you hold all that? So that's what you Thank you very much. We recommend. Can you hold all? Thank there. you. Isn't the cafe also? It's nighttime. Take a so look around. Lunch. Thank okay, you. That's just heat items. Sweet shop. Hello, dear. Come again. Uh. Is it the coffee shop? How may I help you? No. Ooh, That's I am gonna buy that though. Here you come again. Honey toast. What's that? Hmm? Hmm? Okay, so the only vending machine that sells SP items is the one that's in, uh, the arcade. At Sendai Station. Let's get that's to work. perfectly fine. <laughs> Come back in a disguise to get past one per customer. <laughs> Time to cook. I'll lend a hand. Hmm. Good choice. Five. <laughs> <gasps> Go for it. Mm -hmm. Oh, wonderful. I have just enough to make one Yukon sure, stew. Sure, that sounds great. Like, honestly, <sighs> it's the better oh, one of the two. I just can't make the coffee even though it's better. Well, maybe not, because the curry stores SP to all allies instead of one person. Here's what I found. Are you double checking the request? Mission accomplished. It doesn't give. Like, it and of itself does not give much, but. <laughs> You're doing Prison this one? mail. I need Archangel with Umreda drop. Like in the old days. <laughs> You're doing this one? You're accepting this request? You're doing this one? The temptation to do it again. What is everyone's levels <laughs> currently? Probably actually do that. I always do. I never try to do them on my own. There was one time where I was, where I did, and I was like, whoa. This I wanna see, request. what do I need?
Wapo and High Pixie. not have let me see if I can fuse welcome to the velvet room performing a fusion money oh you need at least one in your new self. Choose which... Interesting. Is this the persona? Is this the... Oh, she just registered it if you said yes. some room. Wapo! Okay. No. Not Orthrison. <laughs> I'm not doing the Orthrison Barath one. It's Succubus and Andros can make. I can make Jack Frost! <laughs> Whoa! Choose Is this Oh, I've held it. I have held on to Silky for a while, huh? Probably do want to register Choose it then. Is this be born anew? There we go. It seems that it can gain new power. Choose which is this the persona you'd like? Be born anew. Okay, now I need to put fusion stuff in there. You wish to strengthen it? Well, wrong one. How much power will you? This is. Okay. Awaken you. It seems that it can gain. Choose which. Eh, sure. Is this the. Now, let us begin. And there we go. That's gonna cost money. And I can make that one just whatever. May luck be on your side. Yo, indeed. 
We will make we will make those new personas. This is the request. You're accepting this request? Time to get to work. Are you double checking? You're going to can I canceled it. You're doing what? this one? Okay. Let's do our best. Are you double checking the request? Oh, I have to show it to her. I'll just add this. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Mission complete. Nice. You wish to browse the entries? What will you be registering? Our scent. Will you register? Right now, at this least. This persona has been registered in its present condition. You wish to strengthen I suppose it. I should enhance him. How much pop this is- So that way he'll- I can register him. Okay. Right? You'll you let wish me do to that now? Him? What will you be registering? Yep, there he is. <laughs> will you register- This persona has been registered in its present condition. Performing a fusion? It seems that it can gain new pop. Choose which- Is this the persona you'd like? Oh. Yeah, I don't Choose need to. I don't need to register the slime. Is this? Now, let us begin. No! It's a fusion fail! Different than expected. It's level twenty six. <laughs> oh, my God. I can only afford to make one. It seems so that I will it can gain Kiko. new power. Choose. I suppose I will I've given Maka Jam sigh. <laughs> now, let us begin. Automod, please. We have he ho. all these unregistered personas. <sighs> you wish to strengthen it? How much power will you add? This is what you... I the really want all of our sense skills. This persona. Six, though. Goddamn. Yeah, it's time to head back. Side. <laughs> this is the request. You're already working on this one. Mission accomplished. Yeah, it's weird how you confuse him out. 
when he has, like, way more skills than he would in normal Persona 5. Like, doesn't he stop learning shit at level 10 or something? Well, that might also be putting it too high, because if I remember right, Orpheus stops learning stuff at level 8. <laughs> Or is it six? <laughs> You're accepting this request? Okay, let's do our best. I should write something. Except the Yeah. Unless you're doing the answer, in which then Orpheus starts at like level twenty-six and stops learning stuff at around thirty something. Not that that means anything, because they didn't change Orpheus' affinities, so despite the high level and being able to learn Agilau, he still sucks. <laughs> <Let's> <laughs> Poor <go>. guy. <laughs> I think Orpheus' design is very cool, and I do like that persona. Hey, it's just his stats are atrocious hey, are compared to the is? others. Oh, this is quite a fun. <laughs> Being a higher level does not change that fact. <laughs> yeah, our sons are pretty bad, too. Uh, I think for first nearby. persona's sake amongst the three where you ditch them after a while by fusing them into something stronger. Um, persona 4 Pro Tags is probably... The, I think he is the easiest to is to first persona only. It. Izanagi being Izanagi is probably the strongest of the three. Orpheus is. <laughs> it's because Orpheus and Arsene have two weaknesses that it's like even though all three of their stats are really bad, Izanagi probably has a better time of it than the other two. Bothered with an orf. <laughs> yeah, I'm eating the PB and J. Yes. Um, Orpheus only. People probably didn't even want to try. I'm certain for the people who did bother, I salute you. But I feel so bad because skill cards aren't a thing in three and Fez. But in portable, they are. So. I guess congrats to all the people who now have access to Persona 3 Portable, you can Orpheus only it. Granted, while you could like fusion manip, because we, we talked about this, I tried to get it for a little bit, but then I gave up because I was like, nah, I'm gonna give, I'm gonna give it Niflheim. I'm gonna give Messiah Niflheim, not Ragnarok. Because Ragnarok is a fire skill, if you did the hoop-jumping chaotic nonsense that is the fusion and got one of the ingredients to make Orpheus have Ragnarok, you could fuse an Orpheus with Ragnarok, which is hilarious. But it's... Oh, <laughs> it's not fun. <laughs> Because Orpheus can only be fused from other personas of the Fool Arcana. And 
the only attack spell element he will learn is fire. He cannot, he does not inherit anything of any other element. Most of them are okay for the most part, and then there's Ogin. <laughs> what the? Ah, you fancy thieves seem like best buds. Any of you happen to be How much damage is this going to do? How would that be any of your business? Oh. Oh yeah, I should have a target on. your weakness to psychokinesis is probably eating it right now. A 
Oh, was that too far away? And then Morgana rolls away. All settled. Oh man, that Even money! Like hey, Diorama! Perfect! I can't wait to try oh, this one beautiful. Out. Matterbond almost ranked up again. I may do that one or two more times. <laughs> Wait a second. Oh shit. Yes! Oh, that's so useful. I need to look to see. No more dungeon crawling? Then let's get that. I don't want that. Are you sure I don't want to be able to charge moves quickly? Absolutely positive that's something that I don't want. <laughs> Does it fuck up comboing with him or something? Can I help you fight? Hey? No, it's still sold out. Why? I guess because I haven't done not related anything. I'm guessing you do talk I can take your order when I thank you. Why would someone want to do damage faster? How can I help you? Thank you! Oh no! Why would they? Let's get to work. Never. What? No. I'm amazed he's already at rank 3. Is there a way to look? Probably. <laughs> Got Master Arts. Yeah, he's done. Sends the active time of toughness and increases the chance of reducing damage. Ooh. We've almost got that one. Oh, oh poor Makoto. I really need to bring her to more stuff, huh? Ammo will no longer be consumed! Nice. We do not know, as this is locked. We need to get that one before we can see it. Ooh! Okay, this artwork for her, though, is really cute. Like, these are just their, um, odd attack cards. And level up thing. But that's cute. Sophie's is cute. Alright. This is the re Are you double checking the rec- Good job! You're doing this one? You're doing this one? Time to get to work. Okay. Boca, what are you selling? Are you sure? I'm pretty sure. Having trouble deciding? How is this sell for more when it only ups your endurance by one? Alright. 
Just add this. And then I'll send the calling card. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Take a look. Did we do it? And there we go. I heard 
Morgana getting brainwashed right All as right. she died. <laughs> nice. More bond points. Hmm. Alright, let's see. It looks like Alice's nails are Christmas lights. This one. And I can still up. Do mask manifestation. More masks means more persona points. Dare they stop the cat mobile like, exactly? Then let's How dare. You don't have cat license insurance, so take them all out. Cat license. <laughs> oh boy. Let's get to work. set this up. We're gonna bring Yusuke. I'm gonna bring Makoto. Uh, we'll bring Morgana. We'll bring Morgana. This is the work you are already working on. Mission accomplished. This should be... What are you selling? Are you sure? Things are discounted right now. You should buy some. How many would you like? You put it to good use, okay? You want to put it to good use, okay? You put it to good use, okay? I love how you restock no matter what every time we go inside of jail. Amazing. Now then. Let's save. Yes. Send that calling card. Understood. I will entrust Senkichi with this calling card. Regardless of what drove Natsume down this path, he has been gripped by vanity, turned to evil. If he cannot see the distortion in his heart, then we will lay it bare. Uh. Time to corrupt Kramps. <laughs> uh, Mr. Natsume! Good morning. I see, there's quite a crowd today as well. Uh, yes, about that. <clears throat> I see him. I see him. What is it? Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, do you not know? What? What is this? Well, when the staff came to open the store this morning, it was already like this. They called the police, but they were told to leave it as is. 
to preserve the crime scene. To the ostentatious swindler, Mr. Ongo Natsume. It's too low res for his eyes. <laughs> Just like it's way too low res for mine. <laughs> You are a depraved miscreant who holds others in contempt and steals their work, lining your own pockets all the while. We refuse to overlook the crimes you commit as you wear a false crown. Tonight, we take back the desires you've stolen. <laughs> Honestly, how stupid can you get? Damn it, what nonsense! I am the monarch. My followers are loyal. I had forgot he looked like that. That is, as long as I hold their desires. No. He's gonna turn into a dragon. Proof of my Please turn into a dragon. Please. I won't hand them over. I won't give them up. You foolish heroes are nothing but talk. Come then. <laughs> Alright, his cognition should be changed now. Be funnier if he turned into a rabbit. <laughs> Thank you for all your help, Mr. Detective. <sighs> and with that, I've officially become an accomplice of the Phantom Thieves. Then we all pull out party poppers. <laughs> Objective to fulfill when I take my break. <laughs> Congratulations, Gramps. You are officially a criminal. <laughs> what are you complaining about? You're the one who proposed working with us, remember? We pop party poppers and give him a slice of cake. <laughs> it just says congratulations. As a reward, I'll try to start calling you Zenkichi instead of Gramps from now on. Okay? Inspector Hasegawa is quite a mouthful. Zenkichi is good, don't you think? Okay then. From now on, you're Zenkichi san, alright? I'm looking forward to working together, Zenkichi. Oh, fine, whatever. You've already dragged me along this far, damn it. Now then, the desire should have materialized at this point. It's up to us to take them back and return them to their rightful owners. And in doing so, we'll set his distorted heart straight. Let's do this. I know he saw it, but it's like, he's probably so confused as to how specifically, or, or is he coming with us? Oh, hell yeah. I'll just add this. Yes, it's cat jam time. Let's go. Yeah, Natsume won't know what hit him. Oops. <laughs> I'm sorry. We so stand. the adventure continues. Where to? Hey, I'm picking up something close by. Oh, check out that statue that totally ate it. And hey, doesn't that remind you of how we got to the top in Shibuya? Ready for round two? <laughs> Like the desires materialize. Go get them, guys. Tuh. Yeah, I found out that it. I mean, it's probably just a bot, and it's the instrumental version. You certainly took But I'm still time, really Phantom annoyed Thieves. that there's or should I say, a machine out Joseph there that's like Heroes. copy striking the instrumental version of Life Will Change, as if it were. Amelie's cover, and I'm just like, bruh. <laughs> I'm like, I actually refuted it. I sent a, I sent a refute, and I was like, you can tell in the video that it's playing during gameplay for Persona 5 Strikers. It's not 
Amelie's cover or whatever the fuck. I still hate that. I do not think covers and remixes should be copyrighted well, because it's just stupid. Even if it's transformative, that doesn't necessarily mean that it's suddenly yours. Now, people get having their covers get copyrighted by the original, that's a bit messier. Because, you know, trans- because what I mean by transformative media, it means that you're not just using it word for word. You're doing something to it. But it's like... <laughs> About time we met, eh, Mr. Overlord? Oh my god, the echo on your voice, Ryuji. You're gonna give back all those desires you stole! We'll take them off your hands. <laughs> Such foolishness! You haven't the slightest idea of what you've just walked into. That appearance, that stance. This is no doubt the Overlord from Prince of Nightmares. He certainly gives off that impression. But weren't the fearsome four just dressed like normal people? Yeah, thinking about it, those guys didn't get much love from the author, did they? <laughs> You've come all this way only to fall right into my He's growing us. <laughs> this world belongs to me and me alone. It takes shape solely according to my design. Here, the Overlord reigns justice upon the holier than thou heroes who would dare brand him as evil. Here, you are nothing more than flies to be swatted. I'll enjoy hearing those filthy screams as you atone for your transgressions. That's bold for someone who stole others' desires just to satisfy their own selfish wants. Yeah, if you're really the Overlord, ain't this the part where you get your ass kicked? Would you say you have us under your thumb? Stop. <laughs> Tell me, how many of my demon brethren have you slaughtered while spouting such despicable hypocrisies? Wow, this guy's reading right from the handbook, isn't he? Enough of this. It's time we fought. No matter how brave a facade you put on, it's clear you're just afraid of losing that hollow throne you're so proud of. What was that? Your reign is not but an illusion. Allow us to show you the truth. <laughs> Let's go. Become monster. I'm sick. Of everyone looking down on me. Yes, the time has come for my true power. You wretches shall witness my final form! Oh, please, let's go! He is a dragon! Uh, yeah, 
on this fight. Alright, you're front. Can you please possess? 
Much with this, I'm sure. Easy fight. Over, Mr. Overlord. That was a lot. Now that I, you know how I sit as uh, surprised and overpowered. <laughs> Accept your defeat. But wait! We can rule this world together! You can have half! Oh. My mantle! My magic armor! Don't look at me! Don't look at me! Is that his true form? Looks like it. So in the end, even his identity was just a cheap imitation. It's over, Ango Natsume. You're just a bunch of stupid kids! You don't know how much I'd suffer! It's not too late for me! I've still got my reputation as a writer! I've won an award! I've sold books! It's not too late! It's never too late! You, you think Kutama has more muscle mass than he does? Oh god, she didn't cute you with the sandy. That's good enough for you. <laughs> This fame you've acquired through deception and the brainwashing of others. Is that truly what you wanted? What was the real reason you started writing novels? I... I mean, I... Damn it! Damn it! I tried. I really tried. Just like everyone else. I read and read all through the night. For hours on end, like my life depended on it. And for what? Nothing I wrote was ever mine. It was just another work from Sogo Natsume's grandson. No one... No one ever acknowledged my effort. My effort? Not my work? Not even me! Ah. <sighs> no matter where I look, all I see is a bunch of thoughtless idiots. Slaves to appearances and nothing more! Acknowledge me, damn it! Acknowledge Ango Natsume's efforts for once! I just want someone to see that I really try! I do. Huh? It's very clear just how much work you've put into writing your novels. A life led by creativity is almost always a lonely one. No matter your profession. 
You were battling that loneliness. You braced yourself, pouring your very soul into your writing, bringing it to your publisher time and time again. I will gladly acknowledge such effort and determination. <laughs> there are many out there who would give up that battle, even those of exceptional skill and creativity. To be able to continuously bring life to new works without giving up, however, that is perhaps the most exceptional talent of all. I like how some people aren't even looking at him or even in his direction. Skull looks like he's staring into our soul, and Sophie is looking at something off in the distance. <laughs> there was once a time when you kept fighting. That is one part of your career that could never be labeled a fabrication. Like, the others at least kind of look like they're looking in the general direction, but it's just not... <laughs> not those two. So start over, Ango Natsume. Claw your way back up from nothing and move forward. After all, there are some things that simply cannot be painted without a blank canvas. <laughs> it is because everyone believed in me that I was able to choose the path I walk today. I stopped lying to myself and was able to begin anew. So it is now my turn to pay it forward. Even if I'm the only one in the world to do so, I will believe in you. <sighs> Damn all this phrase. <laughs> Stupid kid. Talking my damn ear off. But you're right. This identity of mine was built on nothing but lies. I don't need it anymore! Well, that was surprisingly easy. I'll do it. I'll climb my way back up. And I'll do it on my own strength! I'll write a novel that'll capture the hearts of countless readers! What was that made just of? like my oh. grandfather before me! I'll write something I can be proud of. To everyone, I swear it! Good. And I'll be looking forward to the day I get to read it. <laughs> Paper mache. You know, I really am stupid. How did I let myself forget? I know now what it is I really wanted. Is collapsing. Come on, we're leaving. Oh, looks like it's over for now. Cage of Vanity. Oh, there are gonna be seven. I knew the other one was called Lust, and I didn't, like, really think much about it. I was like, are there gonna be seven of them? But that one being Vanity... There's, prob there's probably gonna be seven of them. Granted, Vanity is not a seven deadly sin, word for word. Eh. I get the feeling, but I can guess how many cages there are. Or jails. Mission complete. I wonder if everyone's desires have been returned yet. Probably. They all went flying out of the cage after all. I'm still worried. Maybe we should check on the people back in town, just to be safe. Good idea. That said, the jail didn't disappear this time either. Which means we can fight Dragon Boy again. And if I wanted to, I could watch him do the, the JoJo pose every single time we fight him. <laughs> now I'm sure of it. Jails really aren't the same as palaces. Well, we can worry about it later. Indeed. Let's go. Hey. Yes? I feel as though I'm restless right now. Do you know what this is? Something bothering you? I'm not sure what's wrong. Natsumi tried his hardest. But somewhere along the way, he lost sight of what mattered to him. He is a strange person, Natsume. This is the first, the first.
first one and the third one are awful. This is a new start for him. Yes, he did say he would climb back up. He was a crook. <laughs> Waste of talent, if you ask me. Yusuke said Natsume lost his way because he was alone. Whenever I think about that, I feel restless inside. <sighs> Even though Natsume hurt a lot of people and was, for some the time, heartburn. one of our enemies. What is this feeling? Heartburn. Maybe it's sadness. Sadness? Is that what this is? I see. So that's why Yusuke saved Natsume. It was because Natsume's reason for doing all those terrible things was really sad. I think I understand now. Sadness can hurt people, but it can also save them. It can give humans a reason to support one another. I think you're right. Yes, I'm sure that's it. Okay, we should probably get going. So, you know how I was all excited for the Tanabata festival that's coming up? My boyfriend says he's already got plans. Oh, by the way, did you ever finish reading that manga I lent you? I got someone else who wants to borrow it. I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I think it worked. Yeah. Doesn't look like anyone's talking about Natsume anymore. Then, all's as it should be. Attaining fame through some deceptive power doesn't fit his image. This wouldn't have been possible without you being there to open his eyes, Yusuke. You really took charge today, Inari. That's our Inari. <laughs> yep, it was all thanks to the divine grace of the oh-so-benevolent Inari. Praise be to him. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> I can feel a strong bond with my friends. However, we're not finished just yet. We must confirm whether the change of heart was a success. For now, we'll just have to wait and see how things turn out. Ugh. Well, since we've got some free time, can we unwind at a bathhouse or something? Ugh, I'm totally beat. Good idea. We can freshen up a little before we head back to the car. You heard him, Sophia. It's all you. Okay, I'll find the best bathhouse in the area. Ah, uh, not quite rank 20. Sendai press conference venue. Thank you everyone for coming. I've called this press conference to give an announcement, as well as a formal apology. First, my novel, Prince of Nightmares, was recently bestowed the honor of receiving first place in the Sokaisha Awards. I have decided to give the award back. I've also decided to recall all published copies, not to mention take the necessary steps to refund everyone's money. I'm sure you all want to know my reasons for doing so. The truth is, my book, Prince of Nightmares, only one because of my status as Sogo Natsume's grandson. In short, the competition was fixed. In addition, I've also stolen the work of countless other authors, word for word. Lastly, the story I told about writing to inspire a hospitalized girl was nothing but a lie to garner sympathy. This fabrication allowed my book to sell a number of copies it nowhere near deserved. I wish to apologize for this scandal. And I'll start by personally seeing to it that everyone who bought my book is refunded. I promise my writing career ends here. I am deeply sorry for all that I've done to all of you. I mean, the fixed competition uh, thing. Hold on, Mr. Natsume. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Wasn't his idea, but I guess, yeah, if he left it up to somebody else to say it, it wouldn't get done. <laughs> hey! Time to wrap it up! Get everyone out of here, now! Peace, don't interfere! This is my way of taking responsibility! Hey, something doesn't seem right here. Mr. Natsume's the one who put this thing together, right? Do you think the editors were just trying to profit off Mr. Natsume's family name? Uh. 
Hey! Uh, who, who are you? I will not allow this. You... You're the one from the party. I'm so sorry for what I said back then. I will not allow you to cower and run away, Ango Natsume. You intend to make a comeback, do you not? Huh? When you do return to the literary Was world, that show I want to see I don't know. your name on it, not your grandfather's. <gasps> you are going to write a novel that you can be proud of, are you not? One of the NPCs. Oh, then I probably missed it. You're not alone. Thank you. Thank you so very much. Who are they supposed to be? Once everything is rightfully resolved, I will make my return. Even if there's just one person out there waiting to read my stories. No matter what, I will keep writing. I only hope I can one day save someone's soul. The way my grandfather's novel saved mine when I was young. That is why I write. Sheesh, you kids are something else. Barging in on a press conference like that? My apologies. It was imperative that I speak with him. Surprised we didn't immediately get kicked out. Eh, it's fine. All right, well, I gotta run. I have to go question Natsume. Oh, right. Yeah, I guess it wouldn't end with just an apology. Senkichi's really doing his job. It's almost like he's an actual cop or something. <laughs> I am an actual cop. Anyway, it won't take long, so go on and wait for me back at the car. Like we just leave and drive so to our next wrong, location? <laughs> right. We'll leave the rest to him. Do you have a moment? Something about Natsume's been bothering me. What he did was no doubt unforgivable. Nothing will change that. However, was he really like Matarame? Can he truly be called evil like the palace rulers we confronted in the past? Had he simply ignored his editors, would he have strayed from his path? <gasps> He's credited with or... eyes. Am I perhaps just sympathizing with someone who pursues the arts like myself? And what do you think? I don't know. I see. Yes, it is a rather difficult question. Forgive me, I didn't mean to hold you up. We should return to the car as well. Let's go. We should go too, but instead I'm gonna hit up the arcade. Kutsky Connections, got him. <laughs> I'm gonna buy, I'm gonna stockpile on everybody. What you look for that? Can I help with that? Can I see you again? We recommend. Thank you very much. So that's what. Can you hold all that? I don't know if so that's what you're getting. Local, can you so hold I'll just hang you. on to it. I'll buy them. Park. I don't think there's anything else that is SP. So so into the hideout we go. After some time, Zenkichi came to the hideout. And that about sums up Natsume's confession. So once people friended him through Emma, they'd become his fans. It's just like what Alice said. And Natsume's smartphone worked the same as Alice's, too. There wasn't anything off about the Emma app or the phone itself. So we got nothing again? Well, so probably the monitoring thing, right? I didn't say that. Just like before, there were traces of someone snooping around in there. For real? For real. No. This is 
it all mean? It means someone was monitoring both Natsume and Alice. Well, any idea who it is? Sorry, I got nothing. All I found were traces. So Alice and Natsume were being watched by someone. Hey, Zenkichi, did the police know about that? No. The only reason we know this guy exists is because Sakura sifted through Alice's smartphone. So aside from the fact that they both used Emma, this mystery observer is the only thing linking Alice and Natsume together. <laughs> yeah. If the police didn't know that, why would they assume these two cases are related? Well, these are some very peculiar cases. But mainly, it boils down to the nature of the crimes and the timing. The timing? All of the change of heart incidents occurred at roughly the same time, that being within the last three months. Didn't I tell you? Three months ago is around when Emma was released. Well, Emma is being used to perpetrate the crimes, so that makes sense. <sighs> the group behind it seems shady. Damn right it does. That company putting that thing out is suspicious as all hell. What are they called again? Madams? Madis. Madis. Well, at least you got the mad part. For what it's worth, I'm investigating on that front as well. Still, we're talking about a major corporation operating on a global scale. You can't just walk in and start poking around without reason. You haven't found anything suspicious yet? <sighs> Not yet, no. At least, nothing's come up from checking the individuals involved. If our mystery observer was connected to Medis, though, then we'd have grounds to conduct an investigation. Hmm. Do you think there's someone pulling the strings in this case? Always. Come on, dude. You're in a Persona game. Get with the program. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, we probably haven't told him what Persona are, nor have we explained how exactly, like, we're like, oh yeah, look at this place. This is where we go. We're phantom thieves. It's like a world between dreams and reality, mind and matter. And we take their desires once they manifest by s sending a calling card. So, um... Yeah, I don't think we explained shadows or personas or anything like that. So he's still... He's... He's deeper. He's not looking at the surface of the water. He's about, like, ankle deep. <laughs> Somebody needs to just run up and grab him by the ankles and pull him under. Because <laughs> I feel like he's, like, uh, I'm trying my best. Oh, you forgot the bit where we're, like, the number zero. Right. Infinite possibilities. <laughs> like, just imagine, like... Uh, do you think someone's pulling the strings? And, it, and then <laughs> Ziku just goes, Yeah, probably some, like, man-made or hidden god that's reaching out and fulfilling humanity's hidden subconscious desires. And he's like, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> <laughs> and then all of them are like, Yeah, this guy shot a god in the face! <laughs> And he's like, cool. Uh, I'm gonna arrest you now. <laughs> we don't know for sure yet. The incidents are similar, but they could just as easily be unrelated. <sighs> Guess we'll have to see if the other incidents have any overlap as well. <laughs> That's one of the basic rules of investigation. Find what the incidents do and don't have in common, then start narrowing things down. For now, looking into the other incidents is our best bet at scoring a lead. This is true. We'll have to do what we can for the time being. They forgot defeating more gods than most people will ever find. <laughs> and if we look into the other jails and their monarchs, we might learn something new. Then, if we're all done here, I'm heading to Sapporo to see what I can find at our next target. Oh yeah, we've got like... Three days to get over there? We'll rendezvous on the 8th. I'll contact you the day of. Three days? Should be an easy trip with a car. No need to rush. The target's not even in Japan until then. Oh, right. Wasn't there a festival happening around here soon? <gasps> oh, so we're leaving on the 6th. Sendai's famous for its Tanabata festivals. Lots of good food lined up, too. Or so I hear. No, you had to say food! Yes, I did see decorations being put up here and there. We're super food motivated. Anyway, I'll see you in three days. Don't forget. Bye-bye. <laughs> I guess he wants us to rest up while we can. 
Gramps is actually a pretty considerate guy, huh? Well, since we're here, should we put on Yukata and go to the festival? Did we even bring that? <laughs> Yukata. Uh, I can't help but think of our disastrous fireworks festival last year when we got rained on. That's why we're gonna do it right this time. Besides, we didn't have Futaba or Haru with us back then. Count me in. Going to a festival in a Yukata sounds wonderful. I'll wear one too. <laughs> then we got a plan. Sophia, find us a shop that sells Yukata. I've got four hits. Allow me to direct you. Is it 2D? I'm ready to press F5. Dude, it's, he's got it's all the boots! Oh my god, he has a feather mask! <laughs> As one might expect from Sendai's Tanabata Festival, it's quite lively here. Apparently, the locals call it Tanabata-san, and it's said to have originated from back in Date Masamune's time. I, I was ready to hide myself, but no, it's... it's... it's ready. <laughs> hey, that's the dude from the statue, huh? He is not a dude. He is not a Date dude. Masamune, the one-eyed dragon of Oshu. Jeez, what are you, his retainer or something? Oh, there are so many booths. It's hard to pick what to see first. What do you think? Yakisoba. I'm cool with that. I don't know why, but yakisoba from a food stand always tastes so friggin' good. Uh, let's hold off on the food for now. I want to check out all the boots with Lady On first. Speaking of which, ain't those guys here yet? It takes time for a lady to get ready. They're not unrefined apes like the rest of you. Excuse you? We look lovely. Who are you calling an ape? You're the unrefined one, you furball. Well, this furball's got claws, you bonehead! <laughs> Sorry for the wait. <gasps> oh my god, Futaba's is very green and I love it. <laughs> <gasps> Lady On, you look absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> Thanks, Morgana. Sorry, tying the obi took quite some time. What the fuck? It's fitting for the summer. Right. This outfit was made to be worn during the summer, and it matches the festival atmosphere perfectly. Absolutely picturesque. Hello, Feta. You've brought us a much-needed air of refinement. Yeah, according to someone, we're about as unrefined as it gets. Wow, Ryuji, that looks really good on you. Even better than your school uniform. You don't gotta try and make me feel better. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> you made a good choice with that mask, though. Yellow's a good match for this season. Pretty sure it's orange. Okay. I bought a water balloon myself. You gotta get one when you go to a festival. Water balloon? Oh, you mean a yo-yo. No, isn't that called a water yo-yo? Uh, wait a sec. I thought it was yo-yo balloon. No, it's a water balloon. Hmm. What do you call it? Oh, it's region-based, isn't it? That is definitely orange, yeah. Huh. I'm siding with Futaba. Yeah, <laughs> I knew it! I mean, it's only a little bit, but there's still some water inside. <laughs> Looks like everyone's having a good time. We should have a little fun ourselves. Why don't we check out the food stands and get something to eat? Uh, sure! I was starting to get hungry since everything smells so good. Look! They've got all the staples! Yakisoba, yakitori, shaved ice, they've even got cognac skewers! Those are huge in Tohoku. What are we waiting for? Charge! <laughs> Come on, we should get going too. I'm starving. I mean, Ryuji Zukata is nice. Hell yeah. It's just a different Let's style from the rest of everyone else's. If only there were Yukatas for cats, I'd be like, yes, Morgana, wear one. <laughs> Feels as if we're forgetting the spirit of Tanabata. Though I have no objections. I want to see more of the festival too. Show me how to catch goldfish. Have fun with everyone. 
Oh, I had fun with everyone at the festival. I had fun with everyone at the festival. That was so good. Cognac skewers, Ishinomaki yakisoba, Zunda cider. We basically ate our way through Sendai. And it was amazing. Gotta hand it to old man Masamune. He is one cool dude. That's lord to you. Did I do it right, Yusuke? Am I that predictable? <laughs> catching goldfish seems difficult. Is there some sort of secret to catching one? The secret is you don't do it, Sophia. <laughs> Try to stay calm, then strike without hesitation. Trick is to catch them once you've read their movements. Wow, that's impressive, <laughs> Mako-chan. I see. We'll get it next time. <laughs> or you, Yusuke. <laughs> I like him a lot, but... Oh. You're getting a call from Zenkichi. Yo, you guys having fun? How about you? Just working. Moderately, anyway. Listen, I wanted to ask you guys a favor. I'm already investigating in Sapporo, but before you leave Sendai, I'd like you to stop by Toho University. Tomorrow, there's gonna be a session at the Mount Aoba campus. They're gonna jam! <gasps> Not that kind of session. The CEO of Matisse is holding a lecture there. I'm still looking into them at the moment, but the more info we have, the better. We do get to see that lady again. I'd like you to attend the lecture in my place. What's in it for us? I'll treat you guys to dinner or something. The food in Hokkaido is really something special, you know? I'm sorry. Yeah, <laughs> just like <laughs> we're just ringing this poor man. <laughs> like, oh, I'll, oh, it'll a lecture, huh? What's in it for us? <laughs> and just so we're clear, don't draw any unnecessary attention to yourselves. Just go and see if the CEO says anything strange. Do you have a name? His name is Akira Konoe, and he looks like a capable CEO. I'll give him that. Anyway, I'm gonna be counting on you kids. And again, try not to get carried away, all right? So what did he want? I told everyone about Zenkichi's call. Let me get this straight. This guy's running the company that made Emma? This might be a good opportunity to learn something new. Hmm. I suppose we'll find out at the lecture tomorrow morning. Guess break time's over. Time to get back to work. Indeed. University of Toho Lecture Hall. As you all know, life is just an ongoing series of daily decisions. Wait, this is Akira Kanoi? <laughs> oh my god. What's for breakfast? What should I wear today? Every day begins with these insignificant little dilemmas. But then there comes a time to decide your field of study, your place of employment, who you're going to marry. And it's these choices that matter. Yes, people are always looking for the best choice or the correct answer. Madis seeks to provide it for everyone through the power of AI. I am not letting an AI decide who I should marry. <laughs> Excuse you. Emma is a state-of-the-art AI <laughs> designed to integrate itself into our everyday lives. By gathering and analyzing extraordinary amounts of data with perfect precision, <laughs> Emma can help everyone. Make the <laughs> you best lost choice. me at I'm going to let my life choices be determined by a machine. <laughs> Capable CEO seems pretty spot on. Shh, Morgana. It's quiet in here and you are a cat. Wow, he's so <sighs> composed. He's practically overflowing with confidence. Look how clearly he states his company's outlook and principles. He's got everyone's attention. You're right. He's not saying anything particularly suspicious, though. Makoto... Makoto. Well, thanks to Emma, Medisa's stocks have shot way up. You can bet they're one of Japan's biggest enterprises right now. That said, I feel like a company with this much going for it wouldn't have much to gain from changing people's hearts. Perhaps, but that doesn't change the fact that Emma is still a key factor in the jails. 
is through and that people are allowed access. Right. Medis is connected to all of this one way or another, be it directly or indirectly. Hey, do you think there's a real culprit behind all of this? Like, some kind of mastermind? I'm not sure. I think there is. Even if we beat the monarchs, change their hearts, and free everyone's desires, the jails don't disappear. Ah, the dice! It has been rolled! There's gotta be something keeping them here. I was told to roll it. Oh my goodness. Uh, roll the medice. <laughs> the medice. So you're saying the real culprit's the one doing that? I don't know. But who is the real but culprit? Do you remember how even the monarchs themselves didn't know much about Emma? Oh yeah, on break time. That's right. Alice and Natsume said the same things in their testimonies. <sighs> and if that's the case, then the Monarchs might not be the only ones manipulating Emma. Which means it could be someone at Medis. Or our mystery observer. Or our head honcho down there. Or perhaps someone completely different. Yeah, well, we just gotta stick to what Gramps was telling us, right? All we can do is keep solving cases and collect more info. As long as the when there's an end parts to the end of the cutscenes, yes, indeed. Straight. Wow, Ryuji. That was pretty insightful. I'm surprised. He's right. And in that sense, attending this lecture is a valuable use of our time. Let's make sure we pay attention all the way to the end. Which is why we haven't been paying attention until just now. <laughs> Yo, how long was I out? So, what did the dude say? Did you fall asleep? Oh, can I smack you? Well, he didn't exactly say anything out of the ordinary. And again, I wouldn't expect him to trip up that easily. Well, I'm starving, so maybe we should just head back? That guy was talking for friggin' ever. Hey guys, that stuff you said earlier, was all of that true? Oh hey, huh? it's Ichinose. Are you really the Phantom Thieves of Heart? Oh my god, we're so we have not recovered from being stupid. You're the woman from the Beef Tongue restaurant. Oh, Ichinose-san, right? You heard all that? To be fair, they were all talking about Phantom Thief-related stuff. Well, the thing is, I'm really good at picking up when a cat meows. Honestly, I found that way more interesting than Kanoe's lecture. As soon as Morgana talked, she was eavesdropping on us because she heard him meow. Oh, god damn it. Mona? Me? But you guys are the ones she overheard. The hell are we gonna do? Uh, I'm playing innocent. <laughs> Whoa, stop, stop. It's all right. <laughs> Run. <laughs> this place will be closing up soon. Let's talk more outside. Why? Why? <laughs> Wow, to think you guys are the famous phantom thieves. I think you misheard us. Come on now, don't try to hide it. When you guys mentioned Alice and Natsume, I imagine you were referring to Alice Hiragi and Ango Natsume from the press conferences, yes? Guys, we need to stop talking about phantom thief stuff in public places. <laughs> Is it safe to assume those were your doing? Oh, and what was that about Emma giving people access to jails? Oh, is that related to everyone's hearts getting changed? She... she heard everything. Because we need to stop talking about literally ev- No one was talking except for the guy on the mic. Anyone could have heard us. Why were we talking about it there? It's- Ah, it's like in 4. It's like, yeah, they're on the roof in the cafeteria talking about stuff at Juness. But Inaba is, despite the rumor mill, I'm surprised no one, like, overheard any of them. I guess it makes sense that they would ignore a group of high schoolers hanging out in a place where high schoolers hang out. And, but in 3, we never talk about C's stuff outside of the dorm, and if it's not out- and if it is outside of the dorm, it's not in school or anywhere where someone could be hearing us. But the first of 5 
podcast is like, yeah, we've been caught like three or four times. That's how Makoto joined us even. Because she was following us and overheard us talking about Phantom Thief stuff in a public goddamn space. And we did it again. We did it again. We shouldn't have been talking about it. We should have just listened to the lecture. Um, can we ask what you're doing ah! here, Jason? We're so dumb. The Phantom Thieves are so dumb. They're just a bunch of dumbasses. Oh, I told you at the Beef Tongue place, didn't I? I'm a researcher at the university. Oh, that's right. But how would the plot move along without people overhearing us talk about being Phantom Thieves? Uh, our top secret should be a hideout! <laughs> Oh, God damn it! <laughs> I'm also the one who designed the base for Emma. You made the base? I didn't tell you. I specialize in the research and development of artificial intelligence. Oh, uh, okay. We can't trust you then. Have a nice day. He <laughs> leaves. Uh, he definitely didn't hear about that. Around the time I finished developing Emma, Medis came to me with an offer to buy it. I was actually pretty tight on money at the time, so I went ahead and sold it. Is this lady for real? Oh, by the way, that's why Medis is participating in the lecture today. Well, to be more accurate, the university asked me to reach out to them. I certainly didn't expect the CEO himself to show up, though. Yeah, no, you made Emma, and Emma gives people access to jails? <laughs> There's a mystery person with good technological knowledge? So much so that Futaba can't track it? Monitoring people? No one matches that description right now except for you, <laughs> and it's by your own admission. I only got invited because of my little connection with the company. Anyhow, yeah, that's how I ended up being there to overhear everything. I will be more shocked if she's not secretly evil. So you're Emma's creator, and Medis is simply the ones running it? Oh, well, they're definitely the ones running it, but I can't say for sure if that's all they've been doing. I just designed the base. Who knows what Medis did once I sold it to them. So, you know all about Emma then, right? Naturally. It's like my baby, you know. And at the risk of tooting my own horn, it's a really good baby. And then you sold it. <laughs> well, never would have expected this turn of events. Do you think she's telling the truth about designing Emma? I do think it's impressive that the CEO of Medis came to personally give a lecture. If she's the one who made it happen, doesn't that mean she has a lot of influence? This is true. And let's not forget the university asked her to attend the lecture. What should we do? She could probably tell us a lot about Emma. Not to mention she knows who we are now. What do you think? Let's play dumb and run for it. <laughs> I don't want... I don't want- I don't trust it! I don't. But... Let's- Hell yeah. Fine. I guess it's too late to cover this up. Exactly. That's why I think playing dumb and running is not a good idea. Then we may as well go all in and find out what we can. Do, we are not putting nothing her in the jail, are we? Game. Are we gonna be like, hey, check out this jail, lady? <laughs> it's settled then. We'll tell her everything. <laughs> Is all of that true? Right, we know. It's kind of hard to believe, huh? Hey, what if we just show her, like we did with Senkichi? Well, then that would just fully give it away, Futaba, because if we brought her to the jail and yet the intro showed only one of the two in the intro, then it's just... For sure, she is not- she's not- it's not a good idea. Wow! It really does exist! I mean, how else could you explain all this? So Emma functions as the entry point here, huh? No, that's- if I consider the possibilities? Uh, she believed all that? Throw her to the teddy bear! Oh, you hey, you no wanna fight a dire shadow with us? This is. What an incredible <laughs> development! <laughs> uh, well, at least we don't gotta go through the trouble of convincing her. Ichinose-san, 
Do you have any idea why Emma is serving as an entry point to the jails? Makoto, please. Unless we're going to pull another Akechi time and we're like, yeah, the fact that she just took us at face value implies things. So we're just going to pretend to be dumb teenagers, even though we are dumb teenagers and we don't really need to pretend. <laughs> oh, no, couldn't tell you. I'm surprised this other world even exists. There's no way I could have thought of a way to get in if I didn't even know it existed to begin with. Yeah, that figures. Wait, so that means... That function was added later? A world where people's desires are stolen and their hearts are changed. Hmm, so many questions. Oh, wait, maybe I should be heartbroken here. My baby is being used for evil after all. Think you can help? Right. How about we make a deal? For some reason, my headphones turned off on me. And the battery's not low, so I don't really know why that happened. <laughs> it's just like, all of the audio oh, cut out on me beat. suddenly, and I was like, uh-oh, and I looked over at OBS, and it was still working, so, was, okay. <laughs> so I checked my headphones, and I'm like, oh, they powered down. <laughs> I'd be glad to help however I can. <laughs> and I can't say I don't feel kind of responsible for all of this. More than anything, though, I think I'd die of curiosity if I didn't get involved. So, what I do trust you mean her you not. It was a ghost. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us about Emma. Right. Well, for starters, I'm we'd sorry. Like you the to fact that it's in all caps, I have to read state. it aggressively. I just have to. Maybe try and figure out how it's different from the base you created. I see. Basically, you'd like to know the secret behind this new version of Emma. And if someone's responsible, you want to know who. Oh, hey! We found some of those mystery junk parts out there, didn't we? Maybe if she takes a look at them, we'll learn more about that world. Ooh, so you're gonna give me a bunch of neat stuff to analyze? Yes, that's excellent. Just wonderful. In fact, I'll even buy them from you as research materials. Hmm. Well, if this is going to be a deal, then we'll need to provide something as well. <laughs> Nonsense. It's fine just the way it is. My inner researcher is just squealing with delight. <laughs> now look at what happened when we trusted a catchy. What could go wrong? So, what do you say we seal the deal? Uh, it's a deal then. Okay, looking forward to it. Oh my god, she... She's very talented at sounding like I'm super excited at bordering on the edge of just being creepy with how excited I am. You can hear it in her voice. It's amazing. Pack rat! <laughs> Yo, if she specializes in AI, maybe we should ask no. about Sophia. Yeah? No, no, no. Huh? Sophia? No. No, no! Hi. I'm Sophia, humanity's companion. It's nice to meet you, Ichinose. This is Sophia? Huh. It's nice to meet you, too. Who flipped the switch on her? Oh, no, it's just that I've got so much on my mind right now. I guess even I'm a little confused. Ah, we got a raid! The audio is gonna go away as I do this. <laughs> Give me a second. Fruity Cat, hello. Nekorade. <laughs> is this- <laughs> hello, is this meow? <laughs> Make sure I'm spelling that right. Woo! <laughs> Cute. <laughs> Alright, let me do the other shout out. Bop! We're playing Splatoon. Well, hello, everyone who came over from Ruti Cat's stream. I am Zutaku the Beast. I play a variety of video games. Uh, and I am. <sighs> I am constantly. I have been doing this for so long now, but 
Persona Thon. <laughs> ah. Yes. <laughs> Persona Thon has been going on for for a long time now. It's coming up on a <laughs> It'll be a year in March? When did I play Persona 4 Golden? <sighs> but it started with Persona 4 Golden. I have a widget in my About page that explains Persona Thon as well as lists out the games that I have finished. The game that I ha am currently on, such as Strikers, that'll be listed, and the games that are still up in the queue. May. Okay, it was May, not March. The year of Persona, yes. Once we hit May, which I'm certain it's going to, I'll have played all of my JRPGs that I have played for that year, essentially, will be just Persona. And it's like, oh god. It might have started in April. I th maybe it was April, but it didn't officially become Persona Thon. Persona Thon then Summer Sona, um, until like later. Yeah, late May was towards the end of Persona Four Golden, but yeah. Oh boy! Oh boy! <laughs> so we're still pretty early on in Strikers. Um, I, the last game that I had finished not too long ago was Q2, and that was... Ah, yes. Persona 3 Fez. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Sophia's an AI we met in the metaverse. Is there anything you can tell us about her? Oh. <laughs> it really helps to place Innocent Sin if you can. Yeah, unfortunately, Innocent Sin is less accessible to me than Eternal Punishment, because I have Eternal- I'm, it'll be the PS1. It'll be the PS1 version of Eternal Punishment, so it won't be difficulty optimized. I've heard. Uh, but... Yes, eight days till Persona 3 Portable on Steam. Holy shit. I will not be playing it- Um... I will not be playing it when the game launches, but Portable is definitely on the agenda because for uh, for the girl side, it's a completely unique experience in its own right, with the social links being different. How is Strikers going? Strikers is going pretty good. Uh, we beat the second monarch not too long ago, and we are still stuck in the cutscenes and reading. I haven't been able to save <laughs> for a little while yet. We went to the Tanabata Festival, and I am... I'm too good at predicting Five's plot. <laughs> alright, this... Uh, alright, Mia. Thank you for... Thank you for hanging out with us. I'll see you. I'll see you whenever. <laughs> but yeah, uh. Strikers is a lot. Well, I mean, it's still very Persona 5, but it's a lot different because of. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Meow. Mia has to be three A's in order to activate. Yeah. Yeah, I struggled quite a bit on the first boss because I forgot that it's a it's a Koei Tecmo Warriors style game, so <laughs> by the second boss I was like, oh yeah, I know what I'm doing. <laughs> the AI uh, of my teammates doesn't know what they're doing sometimes. <laughs> I like how I like how Yusuke plays because of the counter style, but his AI by not being perfect means that he eats a lot of hits. He 
<laughs> yeah, I hope the Fire Emblem one, because they're making another Fire Emblem Warriors, is better than the first one. But again, Nintendo, I've stated this before, Nintendo is a helicopter mom when it comes to leaving their IPs in the hands of another development studio, so I get the feeling that it's not going to be all that great. Yep. The first one, I was blech. What? When was it announced? What is it even going to be called? I just remembered that the pre-orders opened up for it on Switch not too long ago. There's three hopes. Oh, three hopes already came out. Do I need to play a Fire Emblem Warriors by before three hopes? Blech. Docking engage, it's tactical RPG like normal. Oh, yeah, no, I was talking about three hopes. That was the Warriors one. I like the tactical grid-based RPG style, but I didn't like the Fire Emblem Warriors game. At least the first one, because everyone felt the same. I really like Fire Emblem Awakening. I don't know anything about Three Houses. I wasn't really all that invested in Fates. The three houses are gone and all that's left is three houses. <laughs> it's just like, ugh. No, I can't say I know anything about her. Think you could send me her code later, though? Because it's like, ugh. Nintendo really is a helicopter mom about e everything. And Tokyo Mirage Sessions being an example of that. That's the least Atlas-feeling Atlas game in the existence of man. It's still really fun, but it's like, man. <laughs> huh? Oh, they didn't sure. let them have any no fun. <laughs> well, they let them have some fun because some of the music is awesome. I love the music for Tokyo Mirage Sessions, but it's just like, ah. Oh. I'll give you my contact information. <gasps> All right, Ruti. Thanks again, once again for the raid. Bye bye. Well then, I'm excited to see how this all develops. See you around. I do not trust Ichinose. Eh? I do not trust Ichinose. <laughs> uh, well, there she goes. Would have been nice if she'd known something about Sophia. I'm okay. Would have been as nice as if we didn't out ourselves fast. in front of her. <laughs> Guess that takes care of that. Oh yeah, I totally forgot after all that's just happened. The same but time. we're heading to Sapporo next, right? I don't know. I think I can, since the uh, hover card for it will be in the chat. Yeah, we should get going. Zenkichi's waiting for us in Hokkaido. Either way, ads only play for three minutes, and the uh, submission time for the dice roll prediction is ten. So. Hell yeah! Hokkaido, here we come! Hey, hey! Mm. Oh, is there a request? Heyo! Can I borrow you? There's something I want to do before we go. 
I shall await you at the entrance of the Mount Alba Park Shrine. Okay. Well, I'll talk to everyone. I should write something. Anyway. <laughs> but I can finally take my break. Ah! Nope, and there it goes. Let me pause this recording. YouTube, be sure to pause so you can take your break. And we'll be back in a bit. Okay. <laughs> Rip your points, fraud. Ah. Shouldn't we be going? Next up is Hokkaido. Make sure you've taken care of all of your last-minute shopping and sightseeing. If you'd like, you could even train for a bit in the jail. A little workout before a long car ride can do wonders. You are Ziku. I want to get a picture in this cutout before before we head out. This is a great photo op, so it'd be a real waste not to. Come with me. I've gone ahead and called Inari over too, so you should join in. Thank sure. you. Hey, thanks. Then <laughs> let's start making some memories. Without further ado, it's time to play Who Looks More Like Date Masamune. In the blue corner, we have Inari. That's fine. Hmm, I don't quite follow, but I'll do my best. How's this? Ooh. Whoa, this is crazy. You really do look like him. <laughs> or me. <laughs> Looking good, Yusuke. Hmm. It's like he's wearing armor. How interesting. What's up, Masamune? Very well. <laughs> I can't say I don't like the sound of that. Hmm. Hmm, there's still something missing. Oh, that's right! Oh, I know! Zeke, you get the other one. That's it! <laughs> Here comes the princess! Cute couple! Something is amiss. Ziku, is it just me? Or are we being exploited for her entertainment? Didn't go to say three pyrojack puzzles. Ah. Uh, I guess they're not very fun. We're an item now. <laughs> well, well, if you say so. Right, right. I said that so deadpan, I couldn't. <laughs> Yeah, looks great. But maybe you could get a little more into the role. No. Like this. Aww. Nope, not even close. Look, Inari, you're Lord Date Masamune. As a ruler of the Tohoku region, everyone's throwing mad respect your way. You gotta own it. In that case. I see. Then perhaps like this. You think you can win the respect of your people like that? <laughs> then how about this? <laughs> Uh, Sorry, you actually kind of freaked me out. <laughs> Everyone had fun at the photo stand-in. Oh, listen up! Oh, uh, this Kuan Ichinose seems like a pretty big name in the AI field. So, she's a computer expert who can apparently blow off the whole world around her during a rant. <laughs> The verdict of an ex shut in? Sounds like she might not even be the most social butterfly in the garden. Maybe that means. Well, don't worry. She's got a whole bunch of new friends now, with plenty of experience breaking through to people. Hey, don't sell the power of social anxiety short. Although I will say, a fellow geek is easier than anyone else for me to talk to. Come on, come on! She's gonna do the fan thieves a world of good. So we should just let her do her thing for now while we get to Hokkaido. Oh, Did yeah. you know two million people come to the Tanabata here in Sendai every year? After those crowds we saw yesterday, I buy it. Man, can you imagine if we came here last year? I'd have been KO'd in an instant. But now, I can even go souvenir shopping all on my own. No problem. 
I mean, yeah, it's because I know you're all here nearby, but still. <laughs> by the time this trip's over, I'll be strolling through the crowds all by myself, whistling a little tune. And then you shall cower at my might. <laughs> Never change, Futaba. We'll actually buy those. <laughs> Take a look around. Is that all? Thank you. That's a pop. Thank you. That's a pop. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's a pop. Thank you. That's a pop. Hey. <laughs> Yo, you know, hidden up a ramen joint before we roll out. Apparently, Sendai is all about the spicy miso ramen. Can you believe I never heard of it that way before the trip? You should grab one last bowl for yourself if you think you'll miss it. <sighs> Man, do we really have to leave already? We were so busy, I feel like we barely got to do anything here. I'm definitely looking forward to our next stop, though. Sapporo is the place for ramen. Okay. What would you do that with? Thank you. That all here. Thank you. Is that and? That's what you and? Stop by again. Hmm? Come again. I'll just buy more Gyutan. Take a look. Is that what you want? I'll buy two. Come shop with us again. Oh, wait, it was. Eh, I'll work my way backwards. Your time. We recommend. Thank you very. We recommend. Thank you. We recommend. Thank you. So that's what you. Thank you. So that's what. Can you hope? So that's what. Can you? I'll be waiting for. Can you? Is there a Gyutan burger? How can I help you? Have you decided? Thanks. Come Thanks. back soon. Hmm. That all? Thanks for come again. What will it for that? Yes, come again. Think the chilled pineapple. Day. We had a great time at the festival yesterday. <laughs> Just still, that's a one teenager. In fact, I haven't had that much fun in a good long while. Oh, the food was great. I noticed everyone gorging themselves more than usual. Was the food especially delicious? Hmm. Well, it was good, but I think it was the lively atmosphere that made it so easy to get a little wild. The dazzling lights, the colorful decorations, the roar of the drums in the crowd, my head buzzing from all the laughing. All of these things came together to make a once-in-a-lifetime moment. And so... Got it. Fun things make for special memories. Oh my god, they sound so similar. The last we'll see of the Tanabata decorations for the year. We should take a lot of pictures. We should. Well, a fuck. Here you are. A fuck. Thank you. A fuck. Thank you. Leaving. What is it that you see? We rep thank you. I will buy the Mops of the Patch. What you look at that? Oops. Thanks! Did I? Yes, okay. Low use gay. That's. Mm -hmm. What a coincidence. Look, Kuzika. It's a Tanabata decoration. Beautiful. It may be a standard tourist souvenir, but I find it still has a certain elegant charm. 
Apparently, these festival decorations are not solely for display. Individuals may write down their own wishes and tie them to the branches. Common wishes include the happiness and success of family and loved ones. Receive. Yes. Let's say we display this one in the RV. Considering how wishes and desires are one and the same, it would make a rather fitting souvenir for our trip. Oh! I've been thinking. Oh my god, we can decorate the- <gasps> Money, power, fame. These are what warp a person's true desires. That is what makes staying true to one's heart so important. Exactly. I agree. All the signs and posters of Natsume are already gone. It's like he was never here. I wonder if that means he really- he never actually had anyone in his corner. Wait, please hold that on. That's not the case. I have found a number of posts online where people are supportive of Natsume. Oh, in that case, I think he'll make it just fine in the end. Hey there! Who knows, maybe he'll publish another book at some point. I'd be willing to give it a read. Although, on second thought, I'm not so great with print. I think I'll still be supportive if I waited for the movie version to come out. <laughs> Alright. Sophia just trying to cheer us up. <laughs> Alright. Can I? Oh, I can. I can just be here. Cool. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's, it's high time. Let's get to work. Unless there are requests. Here's what I found. Nope. Although I'll sell my stuff now. This should be. What are you selling? Are you sure? It's that was it. <laughs> now then. being thanked for my work. Also, I hit the mic. I'm sorry. <laughs> to the next city! What are you gonna do? Are we heading out? Let's go. Let's go. We've done everything that doesn't require jail stuff. So, may as well. Alright, let's do this. Sapporo? From here, it'll take approximately 12 hours under normal driving conditions, as well as a trip by ferry. Oh, dang. No way! I thought we were closer than that. Why are we leaving on the 7th? Guess we'll have to stop and snooze another night before we get there. Even after landing in Hokkaido, we still have a long drive ahead of us. Will you be alright, Mako-chan? Don't worry. I'll be able to power the whole way through. You rock, Makoto! I like that energy. A few hours later, a certain parking area. <sighs> I have to admit, I'm kind of exhausted. Don't push yourself too much. <laughs> Thanks. I should be fine after a little rest. That's true. We were in the camper all day. We definitely owe you a break. Let's let Ryuji drive what could possibly go wrong. Outside of the fact that he doesn't have a license, a lot of things. Sorry for Most asking of them too stemming much of you, from the fact that he doesn't have a I license. I wish I could drive in your stead. <laughs> Don't you worry about me. Driving's a responsibility I enjoy. Plus, it's nice listening to everyone chatter away in the back. Keeps me alert and motivated. And we will find a way to repay your devotion. Ryuji, massage your shoulders at once and procure the finest soft-serve money can buy. On it! Wait, why does it have to be me? I'll massage you too before bed. I know this technique that works wonders on sore muscles. Us models use it all the time. That'd be great. I could use a good massage. Makoto, 
I need to apologize. What? Uh, why? Because I can't help you. Even though I know how effective physical stimulation is at treating fatigue. Sophia! But I'm all digital. And therefore, incapable of massaging. Massage. Aww. An AI that can't provide assistance cannot be humanity's companion. I'm as worthless as a book. That is false. Uh, Sophia? Are you going to <laughs> mood swings or something? Let's install Sophia into the RV so we can let her drive. So we'll have Mona Bus and Sophie Bus. <laughs> You're far from worthless. <laughs> yeah, no need to be so hard on yourself. You've been a great deal of help so far. We owe you a lot, Sophia. You mean it? That makes me happy. And I do want to try this soft serve you speak of. Her mood swung right back to normal. Makoto, you look spent. I say we call it a day the moment we reach Hokkaido. In that case, we should treat ourselves to some local cuisine for dinner. Oh, I've always wanted to try wasabi soda. Uh, no thanks. In there, Makoto. Sapporo's just a stone's throw away. I hear you. Hokkaido sure is vast, isn't it? Vast enough to call it huge Kaido by my reckoning. <laughs> it's supposed to be a lot cooler up here, so hopefully we must that bring ice no cream into the jail for her. Nice. Also, because I'm digital, we'll buy the ice cream and then we'll go into the jail and then give it to her. You said it. Nothing more hellish than sleeping in a hot, sweaty tent crammed with dudes. Hellish indeed. We're so overheated we'd nearly strip naked by morning time. I found it obscenely refreshing. You say what? Just make sure you keep the nudity inside the tent, please. I'm yeah, it's, I'm just like. Sapporo! Hello, Sapporo! So this is Sapporo Central City. A bustling outpost of civilization, cradled by the untamed wilderness. Hey, you think they're still doing the snow festival? Are you seriously that dumb? Well, it certainly is cooler here than Tokyo. It should be a nice change of pace. I know we just got here, but I want to check whether there's a jail nearby. Sophia? Oh, no. <laughs> I do smell a jail. An intense one. Just like Gramps said. That means whoever Zenkiji's looking into is the monarch of Sapporo. Then may I suggest we comb the area for intel? Uh, before that, I think we should hit the bath. Seriously, I've been feeling all gross since yesterday. Is it intense or intense? <laughs> Agreed. It would be nice to freshen up a little first. Then let me help. I've already located a bathing facility only 500 meters from here. Wow, Sophia. You work quick. Excellent. Guess it's bath time for you guys, then. In the meantime, I'll be on the prowl for that intel. Don't worry, Mona-chan. I'll rinse you down as soon as we're done. But what No, no, I, I can clean myself just fine. It's just as the data says. Cats hate getting wet. Well, not all cats, but generally speaking. Yeah, kind of. Don't lump me in with those other fur balls. I demand you give your data a full rewrite. I'd like to try a bath. Would someone mind bringing this phone in? Uh, wouldn't the hot water, like, wreck it? Along with you inside? I'm sure we can work out the details. Now, Sophia, will you guide us there? Ah, yes. Breaking my phone because <laughs> Robo Waifu asked nicely. <laughs> this is Odori Park. It's famous for its fountain and TV tower. Bathhouse is in a place called Suzushino. It should only be a short walk away from here. So let's get going. Okay. Oh my god, so many requests. Could I turn down such an adorable face? Oh, 
I could reason with her of the wouldn't you like die? <laughs> Or at least lose a means of communicating with us? I don't think it's a good idea. Hmm. Let's get to work. This is the request. You're doing this one? <gasps> okay. Let's see. You're accepting this request? Okay, let's do our- You're accepting this request? Okay, let's do our best. There's Pink You're accepting best. this request? <gasps> Unlock double cap for bond skill! You're doing this one? Okay, let's do our- You're doing this one? Time to get to work. <laughs> Are you double checking the request? Mission accomplished. Nice. Put that on Kataba right now. <laughs> yes, Futaba armor. stuff? No. Right, that's why there was a request. Who is it for? Next thing you know, she <laughs> <it> weapons. <laughs> there we go. Now then. Here's what I found. So trapped in Wonderland is Shibuya Jail. Okay, let's start the mission. Install some rocket launchers onto Necronomicon. <laughs> Ground area. Okay. Okay, we're in. Stay sharp, guys. It's one of these. Go find out. Oh, 
true form. They put up a fight. Oh, nice one. Show me your Keep true self. They were wide open. Don't let your guard down. Be gone. That victory was handed to us. Okay, let's keep it moving. Shadow sighted. Reveal your truth. We can attack at any time. Let's go. This is our chance. Yeah. Take the You won't escape. It's over. That was almost too easy. Here's hoping the next one's just as easy. What? Show me your true <laughs> self. Much of a challenge, were they? All right, no time to waste. Take this. There we go. I won't hold back. Go, go, go! They're running out of steam now. We're trying to pull out all the stops. I think. Nope, there's a me over there. More Morgana got it. Not even worth my time. Let's keep up the what? pace, shall we? <laughs> Okay. Oh, you remain. Finish them off. You call that a fight? Huh, I nearly fell asleep. Good stuff, guys. Keep it coming. It makes sense. What? I can't see any shadows. Hmm. Here's what I found. You're already working on this one. A place with a bunch of small rooms it's locked, lined up, smelly underground area. I guess it is in here somewhere. What is that? Can we take a look? Got turned around. Oops. <laughs> you said <sense> that. <laughs> All according to plan. There it is. So the rest are in Sendai. It's a shame that there's not a checkpoint <laughs> on this side. Wait. A rare one. It shall not escape. Oh! Grab it, Sam! Gotta exploit those weaknesses! You have to later in the fantasy! Her 
A lot of money. <laughs> oh yeah, I forget. Run is toggle. I've been holding down the right trigger, and it's like no. Once you initiate running, you just run forever. Relevance to my interests. Let's call it a day. There we go. Let's get to. You're already working on this one. Good job! Alright, let's see. Welcome. There's Who accessories, right? Which one? No fear, no sleep, no forget, no burn! No brainwash. Pretty nice. Not bad. Are you sure? How many? Are you sure? Let's do this! I'm glad I'm not the only one. The effect on our face. This is the request. Alright. You're already working on this one. Hi, Pixie. We need to defeat 20. West Garden and Heroes History. You're already working on this one. Fortress, You're already working on this one. Safe. So let's do that one first. Since this will have both. Looks like we made it. All right, let's move out. Huh? That looks suspicious. Show me your true self. <laughs> This is not that. This is just a bunch of slimes. Let's go. Grab it, sir. That is quite a weakness. You pulled that off quite well. Okay. You call 
that a fight? <laughs> I nearly fell asleep. Let's keep up the pace, shall we? I was quite a fight. I can see it. That guy's most likely to just be more horses. I need the flying guys and the dogs, I think. Someone here! here. Come! Grab it, sir! I will strike you down! Well... You're mine! Oh, nice, Joker! You hit a quickness! Amazing! It's over! And that's that! I'm in a very awkward spot, though. Here I thought they'd put up a fight. Here's hoping the next one's just as easy. Shadow sighted. What should we do? Ooh! That's so cool! Pyro Jack I almost feel sorry for them. Okay, let's keep it moving. I'm glad you have finished. Doesn't appear to be any danger present. That's this is the request. Mm. Didn't sound like it was very fun. All right, return Might from jail. Well to regroup. Mostly because I want to see what she has for sale before I go fight Ongo again. Let's get to work. Uh, not what I meant to do, but you know what? It's fine. Hello, Trickster. You wish to strengthen it? You lack the power needed. Close, though. Awaken your new self. Bareth and Arsene, no! But this Wapo is powerful. For everybody know it. Probably you what I'm gonna to do is I'm just it. gonna ditch Silky and Bicorn. Oh, they give me points! Oh shit. Well you okay. Wish to strengthen it. How much power will you add? This is what you Yeah. The power of your mask has strengthened this persona. Nah, I'm good. May luck be on your side. This is the request. Are you double checking the request? Mission are you double checking the request? Mission accomplished. Well, this should be helpful. What are you selling? Are you sure? Okay, now I can buy Yuton from her. Because it's local. Yeah. Who is it for? Me. <laughs> you want this one? Do you want to equip that? Thank you very much. You want this? Do you want to equip that? Thank you very much. You want this? You want to equip? Put it to good use, okay? You want this? You want to equip that? Put it to good use, okay? You want this one? You want to equip that? Put it to good use, okay? You want this one? You want to equip that? Thank you very much. You want this one? You want to equip that? Thank you very much. What are you selling? Are you sure? Um, are you sure? How many? Are you sure? Are you how many? Are you sure? How many? Are you sure? Okay. I probably can't afford her thing, so I that's should write fine. No. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Thank you. 
Here's we found something. Hmm. I don't see any shadows. All right. Let's go. It's blessed ice. <laughs> fire right now, am I? Oh, I'm not. I drain it. Right. Hell yeah. Freeze a boss. Yeah. Just 
Oh, I just pushed Makoto out of the way. Complete. Fantastic. So much for I'll never end again. So she just So she just hums like that. Yeah, I mean you kind of figure out how the game works. Oh to Lord defeated. <laughs> But at the same time, it's like, I don't know. Let's get to work. Maybe it's just me. <laughs> Atlas was definitely tougher because I was not treating it like it was Warriors at that point. But then I remembered. Oh, Here's yeah. what I thought. You're already working on this one. Good job. Welcome. What are you selling? Are you sure? No, I do need the shop, sorry. <laughs> this should be helpful. Here I'm on. You want this? You want to equip? Thank you very much. You want this? You want to equip? Put it to good use, okay? Who is it for? And then I gotta buy armor for. How many? Are you sure? You skate. Are you that's sure? About it. Yes, we can farm a new boss for EXP and money now. I should write some. Amazing. Something. about that guy. Mommy, do you think Kaho-chan will like these? I do. She'll say, thank you for the pretty flowers. If only heaven wasn't so far away, then maybe I could see her. Did something happen over there? They're leaving flowers. Maybe somebody passed away. Now that you mention it, I do recall there was an accident on the news. Something about a snow sculpture collapsing in Odori Park? It ended up taking a young girl's life. Maybe that was where it happened. I can only imagine the sorrow her family must be suffering. Mm. Yeah. What's wrong? Are we not taking a bath anymore? Oh, Sophie. Hi. No, 
now we're in Suzu Shino, which is apparently a haven for pedestrians around this time. I wonder why it's so crowded, though. Everyone's talking about voting. Let's go. Well, no matter. Back to the bathhouse. Just go straight for a bit, then take a right, and you'll be there. Hmm. They're only open at night. Interesting. Hello. Hi, welcome. You don't have anything to you unique again. at this Big Bang Burger, so I won't bother buying stuff from that one unless I absolutely have to. Hmm? Okay. Hmm? Wait, set me a shock? Okay. Oh, there's stuff on the other side. Well, I have to check all these places out. So there's a place only open at night that I'll have to think about. Hey there. Jesus, please. Thank you. Oh. Yeah. Made your choice. Thank you. Please Baby come again. Surgeon. Again. Oh, thanks a bunch. Yo! open only at night. Hmm? Manta, Creature, and Chunky Potomach. <laughs> Tree store? How can I help you? Tuna, lamb meat, flour miso, cabbage. That all? Here you go. Now I have no Thanks. money. Yeah, right. Darn. <laughs> Okay, we're here. Ooh, what a fancy spot. Okay, go get yourself cleaned up. Ah, now this is paradise. I'll say, the heat has crept into my bones. I miss the place near the blood. <laughs> Temperature's perfect. Nah, this really melts the stress. I've away. learned a valuable lesson on this journey. Sometimes you simply need to enjoy being naked. Yusuke, I. Words come out of your mouth sometimes. <laughs> and that means what exactly? Anyways, it's nice <sighs> having a bath like this all to ourselves. Can't get that at home. The. I think they are Tanuki. What's more, we're in the middle of a long journey. We must take proper measures to recover our strength and stamina. Whoa, on! Are those CGI? <sighs> I can hear voices coming from the girl's side. What cheat codes did you use to get those? Dieting life hacks? You're so skinny. Yeah. 
Could you stop drawing attention to me? Go bother Haru instead. Hers are no different. Uh, stop it! Haru, not bad. These could knock someone flat. Papa, stop. Could you please keep it down? Remember, it's not only us in here. <laughs> Looking good, Ryuji! <laughs> oh, thanks. I've been really working these abs. Wait, what? <laughs> Man, this water feels great. <laughs> just a oh God, I really should have been here. <gasps> oh. Sophia might like it as well, though. Being incorporeal may pose a challenge. She really is a mystery, ain't she? What are your thoughts on her? She's humanity's companion. That much is obvious, but didn't she say something about wanting to understand people's hearts? Ah, oh, the heart of mankind. Try as I may, I have yet to depict its full essence in my paintings. It hides both darkness and light. Mingling beauty and atrocity in its depths. Try as you may to unravel it. Its enigma grows deeper still. Hmm. Not sure I can comment on that. But I do know Sophia gets along with all of us. Gets me thinking she might not need to worry about all that heart stuff. <laughs> she does it so she can grow. That is indeed a logical conclusion. Particularly for a sentient program. Understanding the heart would certainly prove helpful. Uh, yeah, what you said. She seems pretty dead set on it, too. If that's what Sophia has decided, we should lend her our full support. She is our precious ally, after all. <laughs> True enough. She could use all the help she can get. Damn, the heat's starting to get to me. Want to ditch the bath and grab some milk coffee? Oh, goodness. Ooh, both of these sound nice, but I'll do this one. Whoa, that sounds good too. Now I can't make up my mind. I protest. We are in Hokkaido, as you may recall. It would be a sin to forego its fresh dairy offerings for some artificial substitute. To appreciate it properly, we must partake right as it's squeezed from the udder, the way farmers have done for millennia. Yusuke. Yusuke, y Yusuke. Uh, yeah. Knock yourself out, man. Seven point get! All right, body and mind refreshed. That bath was just what we needed. Thanks for suggesting this place, Sophia. No prob, glad I could be of service. I noticed you guys were pretty quiet. Oh, uh, well, <laughs> you know. Huh? You have a phone call from Zenkichi. Greetings. You are now speaking to the long arm of a wolf. So, you guys in Sapporo yet? Who is this? Zenkichi Hasegawa? Come on, you know it's me. Anyway, I wanted to set up a meeting. How about I swing by the RV in the evening? Zenkichi's gonna meet us? I mean, it's not like he'd be in any before. trouble. It'd just be like, yeah, we kind of overheard you, and we felt like, you know, maybe we should leave, but we ended up talking about something else instead. <laughs> and Yusuke was Yusuke. <laughs> Now that we're all together, let's talk about the Monarch of Sapporo. Our suspect's name is Mariko Hyodo. It was! Oh, and wait for it. She's the mayor of Sapporo Central. <laughs> You're beginning to think you like Ken more than Yusuke? Oh no! Our target's a mayor? No way! Wouldn't that make her the most influential person in Sapporo? How could someone like that be a monarch? But second worst has competition. <laughs> so we changed the topic to Sophia instead. And Ryuji's abs. And milk. And being naked. <laughs> that 
was Yusuke. <laughs> Shido wasn't so different. This is true. Such things have happened before. How'd you find out she's the one? Because everybody is suddenly in love with her. Mayor Hyodo's approval rating now sits at a lofty 88%. She gained 50 points in the last two months alone. Did you say 50? So she got crazy popular out of nowhere? It's more than just crazy. It's unheard of. There's more. Last month, three city councilmen who opposed her bill admitted to corruption and resigned. Any remaining councilman who opposed her suddenly became her most fervent advocates. Yeah, no. He just appreciates it, I guess. Not to mention the elections coming up. It's all too convenient. Rumor has it, Shoto wants to expand her political influence to the national level. PubSec's been investigating that. But, alas. We haven't run across any solid leads just yet. So, what do you make of all this? Someone's changing hearts. Bingo. And that's where you come in. It is suspicious, I will admit. But we'd need a keyword to confirm whether she's a monarch or not. And it's not like we can walk up to her and be like, Hey, wanna be friends on Emma? That won't be a problem. She's already referenced Emma several times in her speeches. Meaning there's a good chance she's been announcing her keyword in public. Oh. Well... So you're saying we can find out her keyword if we go see her speak? Very likely, yes. In fact, Kyoto's gonna be in Suzushino on the 10th making a speech. Since it's close to the election, the crowds may well be in the thousands. That's a grip. If she's indeed changing people's hearts, then perhaps this is no surprise. Hmm. <sighs> is something wrong, Haru? No, it's just... It's hard to explain. Mariko Hyodo. The name seems familiar somehow. I mean, she is the mayor of town. Maybe you've heard her name on TV. Possibly. Are you sure about that? <laughs> Sorry. Let's put that aside for now. Whatever you do, don't try and contact her directly. I'm saying this to keep you safe. It'll be a downright pain in the ass if she finds out we're onto her. I suggest you enjoy your leisure time until the day of the speech. Hey, should we tell him what happened with Ichinose-san? She's an important part of our investigation now. Yeah, he should know. All right. You two have something you want to share? You made a deal with the inventor of Emma? Wait, hold on. That's Kuan Ichinose, you said? Where have I heard that before? Right, she was on my report. Ichinose's the one who wrote Emma from scratch. Were you looking into her? I was looking into Medice, actually. It wasn't long before her name popped up. The famous inventor who sold off Emma to Medice. Tell me, how'd you get cozy with someone like that? <laughs> she likes cats. Oh, well, uh, I guess it just sort of happened. What matters is her familiarity with Emma. If anyone abuses it, she could help us find out who and why. Only Ichinose knows Emma's ins and outs, no matter what version it is. Makes sense. The report didn't make her out to be somebody dangerous. And while she does sound like a valuable source of info, I really want you guys to be more careful huh? about this operation. I'm trusting you guys a lot by sharing all this classified intel. So I'd prefer you don't go creating liabilities like this behind my back. Well, we didn't tell her about you, at least I think. Understood. We'll take your advice to heart. Oh, well, Kuan is one of the rarest PS2 horror games. That's <laughs> good. And besides, oh my god, I love I that game. Your go-to guy for help. No. Seeing you guys run off making confidants left and right makes me feel like a lonely old man. Are you trying to gain our trust or get attention? Hate to say it, Gramps, but we do shit on our own because your help only gets us so far. What? It's not my fault I'm not an expert on all this cognitive mumbo jumbo. Do you want to be? And would it kill you to ditch the Gramps? I'm as fly as any one of you kids. How do you do, fellow kids? <laughs> Uh. Mm hmm. At least say something. 
Van Gogh is a statement. I don't need your pity. <laughs> You're the one bringing it up. Never mind that. Point he is, sounded like he was a about to the cry. Aw, poor guy. I wish there was something we could do until then. I'm not a fan of waiting. What else can we do but be prepared and keep ourselves in top condition? It's like Zenkichi said earlier. Let's enjoy our leisure time and make the most of our trip. Hey, uh, since we're in Hokkaido, we should chow down on seafood. I hear Hokkaido's soup curry is also not to be missed. I'd like to visit the former government office. Their flowers are supposed to be breathtaking. Okay, then I'll set a route that takes us to each of those destinations. Thanks, Sophia. The directions are all yours tomorrow. Nice. Former Hokkaido government office. Check it out. It's actually pretty hip for such an old place. Well, it's pretty. It was once the main office for the Hokkaido government. Now it remains a symbol of the island and an important cultural property. Simply marvelous. There's a stillness and symmetry here that ignites my artist's soul. And the flowers are nice. And the garden is so lovely. Exactly. How many kinds of flowers do you think there are? What's going on over there? This flower is completely wilted! How could you overlook this? Ma'am, I'm so sorry! It's just, this summer's been much hotter than last year. Spare me your excuses. This flower bed is one of the city's main points of attraction. Have you forgotten you work for the most powerful woman in Sapporo Central? Perhaps you won't much longer. I've heard her voice, too. She's... The only reason why I recognize it is I'm pretty sure she's... <laughs> I'm pretty sure she's, um... I, I won't look it up because I'm probably going to spoil if I look up Stryker's voice actors, but... She's in Bug Snacks. I think she's the, uh... Oh god, what is her name? Please, no! I'll do anything to fix this! You can keep your eyes glued to these flowers around the clock for all I care. Just do not let this happen again. Then that's what I'll do, Mayor. Jeez, that's one scary lady. Well, hold on. Did he just call her Mayor? Well, 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 well. Oh, are you all here for sightseeing? I'm sorry you had to witness such unprofessional behavior from our staff during your visit. Oh, no. Hmm. Could it be? You're Haru-chan. Huh? Of course you wouldn't recognize me. You were tiny the last time I saw you. It's me, Mariko Hyodo. Your father, President Okumura, was a very good friend of mine. She's the mayor? Whoa, okay, guys, don't panic. Oh, could it be your Mari-san? Yes, yes. Oh, that lifts my heart. It's been ever and she's so gonna be long. weak to psychokinesis. <laughs> I should get a persona prepared for that. Uh, Haru, do you know this lady? Yes, of course I do. She used to come visit me back when I was little. Mari-san was one of my father's clients. They used to go golfing all the time, and she'd always keep me company whenever I was bored or lonely. Some freaking coincidence. Ooh, you got that right. It's someone else. She wasn't in Bugs Nights. Nice. Okay. She just sounded really similar for a second when she was yelling at that guy. Haru-chan, I'm so sorry about what happened to your father. Oh, it's okay, Mari-chan. We got our revenge. <laughs> Oh no, thank you for your concern. Well, if there's anything that's been troubling you, you know that I'm here for you with okay. open arms. I appreciate you saying that, but I'm okay. I have good people managing my company, and I'm working hard to finish my degree. And while I'm grateful to be surrounded by such wonderful people, 
I still have to walk on my own two feet. Haru-chan. My, how you've grown. Mari-san, I'm not a little kid anymore. Oh, please forgive me. It seems my emotions got the better of me. Now then, are you here visiting with your friends? I hope you're all enjoying Sapporo to the fullest. Rest assured, my staff is working hard to make Sapporo a beautiful and worthwhile destination for all. Don't just stare at the ground. Replace these hideous flowers at once! It's okay, Mari-san the murderer died to a stray bullet from a clone of himself, Haru says with a smile on her face. <laughs> I'm on it! Then she's just like, that's lovely. <laughs> ah, goodness. The moment I turn away, they all start slacking off. Ah, I'm sorry you had to see that. Now, as much as I'd like to keep chatting, there are preparations to be done. <laughs> Must you say that with a smile on your face? <laughs> this election has kept me busy night and day. But do let me know if there's any way I can help. Sorry to be so blunt, but she seems really two-faced. Mari-san, you used to be so kind to everyone. You think maybe she's not the monarch we're after? Um, on what do you think? <laughs> no, we just saw her go apeshit on that guy. Normal people don't get pissed over plants. Are you okay, Haru? Yes, I'm fine. Just a little surprised is all. Oh, and sorry I didn't get her keyword. I was... Preoccupied. Nothing to apologize for. Yeah, it's like we discussed. We'll hear it when she makes her speech. Makoto's right. Our chance will come. For today, let's go around asking for rumors on Hyoto and make that our objective. Yes. I'd like to find out what changed her. Investigation time! Mm-hmm. <gasps> How may I help you? <sighs> Masquerade parfait. Stop by again. Oh, and a res item. Holy shit. What's the other thing that hmm. is only open at night? Vending machine mm, for pharmacy. See. Where was it? Oh wait, it was it was uh I'll talk to you in a moment, use game. Yeah, okay. right. It was here. Right? What no. you looking for? Come on, get... I'm just playing so it's closed. This place. What will it be today? No. Come again. Hold on, which one was it? Oh, it was this place. Can I help you find something? Yeah, Kitari. Okay. See you again. Hey. Hey. Mm-hmm. Milk and fish? <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, my tonight I'm doing good. How are you? Oh, there's a north and a south. Interesting. Okay. A natural no criticism hmm. suspicious indeed <laughs> what do you have Ryuji Good grief. Uh, yeah <laughs> okay, he's distracted Looked at everything. Hmm? I haven't looked at everything or talked to everyone. There's no such thing as an honest politician. Oh. Well, she's not wrong. <laughs> Necessarily. Yoda's gonna make tomorrow. <sighs> oh, Velvet Room. Hi, Lavenza. I've been waiting for you. It seems that you and your friends are becoming much stronger. However, the shadow of calamity creeps ever closer to your path. Please bear this <laughs> in mind. Just give the ghost a fist of justice. <laughs> How close is it? I only know that an evil is worming its way into being, though I know not its true nature. As for the topic at hand, I summoned you here to notify you about your power of the wild card. Well, that would make Nokatora envious. <laughs> the no. number of personas you can maintain has increased due to your growth. Up to ten personas. Nice. Your potential to wield multiple personas comes with endless possibilities. Hone this power alongside the companions with whom you formed unbreakable bonds and prepare for the coming calamity. Whatever else you may need, I'm here for you. Okay. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Oh. <laughs> Performing a fusion. I don't want to use our sen, so I will leave. What? Oh, I didn't go in here of my own free will. It was just after we talked, she was like, you want to do Persona Fusion stuff? You know, just in case. I'm sure you are all aware of the prior corruption that plagued our city council. Make no mistake, no one is more ashamed than I. If we start a cutscene now, we'll be done by midnight. No, that's end game. As Persona such, 5. The ethics bill I propose will leave no more room for corruption to rear its ugly head. With your support, I will make this city of Sapporo a beautiful, stainless paradise. Like fresh, 
snow on a midwinter's day. Together, let us turn our home into a beacon of light to the world, where both citizens and government leaders radiate truth and purity. Now, everyone, let's clean Sapporo up! We're on it, Mayor Hyoto! Mayor, that was incredible! Holy shit! It's like we stepped into a cult! Her popularity is unbelievable. Do you think everyone here had their hearts changed? Crowds have a tendency to attract people. I imagine some of them came of their own volition. Like us, sort of. Haru. <sighs> Look, Yodo has her phone out. She's gonna say it. Be ready. I'm sure you're all familiar with Emma, yes? I'm also no stranger to technology. So please feel free to add me. For those of you listening outside Sapporo, outside Hokkaido, or even outside the country, this invitation extends to each of you as well. The keyword is Snow City. <gasps> well, there you have it. Snow City? She's gonna be ice. She's gonna be weak to fire and psychokinesis. The whole audience is friending her. Shouldn't we be stopping her right now? No. Causing a scene here would only draw unwanted attention. I hate to say it, but all we can do for now is watch. We can at least be glad we got the keyword. Now we yeah. can infiltrate Hyoto's Shido's... jail anytime we like. I mean, Shido didn't get to where he was by stealing people's desires. He got to where he was by having his son kill the competition. The smell here in Suzushino isn't too strong. Getting inside the jail won't be a problem. So the preparations have been made. Then let's go, everyone. If Mari-san really is the monarch, only we can stop her. We can't let her toy with the hearts of innocent people. True that. Let's blast through this jail. All right. Then let's ready up and begin infiltration. People are filing out after the speech's conclusion. Time to make preparations for the jail. The safest way in and out is near the crossing, where you can see the big sign. Once you're all ready, gather there. Roger. We'll be exploring a new jail. There's no telling what's waiting for us there. Let's be sure we're ready. Noticed. Are you okay, Haru? Mm hmm. Leave it to me. Thank you. Now, shall we go? is only open seasonally. Hey! Let's get going. Thank you for the grilled corn, Makoto. on the menu. Yeah, let's fire it up! We making this? Have I made this yet? All done. 
Eat this great. Time to show my skill. All done. That was pretty good. <laughs> Why? Are you proposing to him for you, G? Well, I mean, just gotta learn to make ramen. <laughs> Time to show my skills. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Okay, that's uh, everything. Hmm. Now we got bond points. Hmm. But I should level up my cooking. <gasps> it's Max! Probably want to preemptively get that one. Discount one eventually. What are you what are you selling? Anything? Are you sure? Okay. This is the request. Okay, nothing else. Yes, true master chef status. Let's go. Coffee Dad would be proud, indeed. <laughs> It, she is most assuredly the monarch. Now then, well, saving is probably a good idea. A city encased in ice, its serenity belies a yawning desolation. Uh, well, what is the scale? Is one cold or not very cold? this jail means that Mari-san really is the monarch. Noir. It's okay. My main concern is returning everyone's desires. Ten being the coldest? Uh, eight or nine. There's a building in the distance that looks like a castle. Should we go there? Leather gets cold pretty quickly, but it also gets really hot really quickly. So if she's running around, she'll probably be fine. Yeah, that's where the desire's gotta be. But if she's just standing still, yeah, she's gonna be cold. Okay, <laughs> then let's make investigating that castle our top priority. All right. There's a chilly haze over everything. Intruders, get them! Yeah, no, it can't be comfortable, but that doesn't necessarily mean that she'll be really, really cold. Shadows, defeat them and move on. Yeah. <gasps> Jack Frost's! It's a bunch of hee hoes! Fire. 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 Fire.
Slime, Jack Frost, Wapo. Take this. Yeah, Let's go. What are you doing? Wind and light. Jack Frost, Slime, I said, I'm in a Uzbera. I'm in a Uzbera. Oh, and. Wait, what's Rick to do? Oh, it's tactical. You're mine. Super got in a follow up attack. Oh my god, so these have. Guns! Oh, yeah, fear. Oh, thank you. Seems I've gained new power. Boofala, goodbye, Boofala. Oops. Speedmaster. Too cold. It's up to you. Can't move. Sure. Can't I just wait here? Absolutely not. What if shadows were to ambush you? Be strong, Oracle. Fine. <laughs> I see a shadow. Here's we found something. I was quite a fight. There's gotta be stuff around. This is our chance. Wanna give him a last surprise? I'll yes. <laughs> Oh, these poor little ones, you know. Too easy. Let's keep up the pace, shall we? That poor, the poor Heho. <laughs> I'm sorry. I have to. Oh. Ah, we can always use it. A frozen spoon. We're gonna sell it. Shadow sighted. We got him right where we want him. I'll reveal your true. <laughs> I have to! Wide open! Now! This will be a piece of cake! Me? 
So far, so good. Show me your true it still has a voice. I'm sorry. <laughs> like the that was just. Come on, I'm frozen, and my defense is lower. I'm picking up a shadow nearby. Ready anytime. It's it. amazing. <laughs> you just walk up behind. Let's go. Push on through. This way to go. Let's show them what we can do. I'm sorry, Jack Frost. Wait, there's an enemy right there. Huh. And here Take I this. thought they'd put up a fight. Oh, oh this nice is a scout. <laughs> Keep it up. Please I was like, how did I oh, not oh, see no. it? Take it? Oh, nice Joker. You it. hit its weakness. You pulled that off quite well. That was kind of expensive, bro. Joker got in a follow up attack. You got him now. Nice. I'd call that an easy win. You should apply this well, to the next battle. What are you doing? Let's finish them off in one blow. You won't escape. The battle's almost won. Let's finish this. This <laughs> is the way he walks. This. this fight is ours. some more. Hmm. Okay, there was nothing. <laughs> Just ice. Oh, <laughs> never mind. There was something. This will help us out, right? A frozen spoon. Yes, it'll be very helpful. <laughs> Let's go. Huh? This composition. I'll reveal your true Excellent paint. Probably shouldn't have something that's ice. Part set. Slime, Jack Frost, Wapo. Yeah. All right. Most of them. Don't let us, guys. He's the Jack Frost! <laughs> he went flying! Is everyone alright? Okay, let's move! <laughs> Makoto hit him with her bike and he went flying! Yes. <laughs> what snow is like. <laughs> it's all white and crunchy. Just don't roll around in it, Sophie. Blend in so much, we might lose you. Ooh, that was my shoulder.
So I'm guessing more legs eventually. Amazing! should be just beyond here. How far does this ice wall go? Doesn't seem like we can just break through it. This place is so cold and empty. It's chilling to think this is how someone sees the world. <sighs> it's over for me. Getting so sleepy. You're okay, Futaba. Oracle has fainted. Come on, stop fooling around. There must be an alternate route somewhere. Huh. That way is also blocked off. Then our only option is to follow this route. Let's take it as far as we can. What's up? Very well. We shall analyze our surroundings and find a proper solution. Yo! It's cold as balls out here! If I don't start jogging, I'm gonna freeze in place. So says the jock of the group. Hey, what else can I do? Every second we waste, that old hag gets another heart in the bag. Skull's right. We need to keep moving. Yes, let's explore the castle perimeter and figure out the secret to getting in. Okay. Hmm. Oh, there's the checkpoint. Wonderful. I should write something. A perfect stopping point. <laughs> Maybe not perfect, but y you get what I mean. <laughs> the music to this place is nice. Hmm. 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 I'm guessing I could just leave now, if I wanted to. Countless EOs have lost their lives here. <laughs> well, darn. <laughs> Nothing I can do about that. <laughs> I must fight to get stronger, and if the main enemy is gonna be a Jack Frost, I'm gonna have to kill a Jack Frost. <laughs> a lot of Jack Frosts. <laughs> All right. Say goodbye to YouTube, everybody. Bye bye.